Hey, it's Josh, and I'm here to review Living Dead Doll Series 6 Hush. The coffin for Series 6 is the standard black coffin with the Living Dead Dolls in the in the silver metallic writing. The Series 6 have the coffin handles with the bats. On the inside, we can see Series 1, Damien, Posey, Sadie, and Sin. Each coffin comes with a silver screening which says Living Dead Dolls in Silver. It has two cobwebs here. It says I'm Dead here and a spider right there. Pure Evil and another cobweb right here. I Sleep with the Worms and another cobweb here. For spooky kids ages 15 and up and then the Misco symbol. When you first buy your doll, if it's sealed in the coffin, it will come in the coffin like this with the doll tied to the back with these plastic ties, one from the head and one for each foot. Series 6's tissue paper is a dark pink, then they have the chipboard with a close up of their face, their name here, living dead dolls in the corner and a small poem right there. The poem says, Shy little hush and her pet rat shriek, dwelling in the sewer, these two are sure to reek. If you first buy your doll and it's still sealed, and you don't know where to find death certificates or accessories and things like that, if you pull back on this, they will be taped into there. That's also where you'll go to untie the doll from the back if you, if you wanted to. My apologies for the noise, it's my hamster. Each doll comes with a death certificate that's tied with this red ribbon. And the death certificate looks something like this. I'll read it out for you. It says, I hereby certify that on the 20th day of December 1971, Hush. Shy little Hush thought rats were so pretty, so it was her good, it was her good fortune she lived by the city. It was easy to sneak into the sewer each night to offer her pets a cheesy delight, but one silly slip landed Hush on her head. It was right there she drowned and the rats were well fed. And it says to the morticians, there's Damien Glenek and Ed Long, which are the creators of the dolls. It has a small stamp here, and it says Living Dead Dolls, and it has Mesco in the corner. Now on to the doll itself. What attracted me to Hush was her simplistic beauty, yet she has a lot going on. So her hair is actually black yarn, which is very soft. She has these cracks going all over her body, onto the arms, and even down to the legs. Let's see if we can get you to see that. There we are. Her eyes have a lighter pink shading, then the outer eye is black, inner grey, and then the pupil is black once again. She has black lips. Her dress is this silver satin like material with ruffles on each layer of the three layers that it comes in. She has these ties that are like the straps here on the shoulder. Under the second ruffle you'll find a bow and as you can see the discoloration because it goes grey because obviously she's round so it would be all wet and dirty because it's a sewer. She comes with black nail varnish on her fingers, as you can see there. And this doll does not come with any shoes, which can be problematic when trying to stand the doll. But normally she stands quite well. Series 6 comes with, each doll comes with a pet, so this is Freak, her pet rat. He has red eyes, red in the mouth, which I'm going to guess is blood. These big long claws, long feet, rat tail, scuff of fur there, and a little bit of brown fur there. When you squeeze him, he feels a bit like a dog toy, 
if you get what I mean by that. So this is her, and that concludes my review. In my opinion, she's a fantastic doll that you should all get in your collection. Because obviously she's now being resurrected recently, and the resurrection is absolutely stunning. Well done Damien Glenn, I can add long for that. But tell me what you think of Hush and her new resurrection friend. Would you, do, you have re, do you have Hush in your collection? Who is your favourite doll from series 6? And what other dolls would like me to review as I have about 54 and more coming. Leave a like in the comment. Uh, keep, leave a comment if you like. And a like if you like as well. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.